Hello, crowd, and welcome to a new Let's Play of a game that's been on my radar for quite a bit called Super Liminal. It's like subliminal, but super liminal. Get it? Got it? Good. Uh, this game actually, it came out, I don't even know when it came out. I think 2019? Maybe early 2020. Maybe, but I think 2019. Uh, yeah, and like I said, it's been on my radar for a bit. Uh, I, I actually read about it in um, Game Informer, back when I got Game Informer magazines, like, while it was still in development. And it gave me, very, like, really big um, uh, Stanley Parable vibes, and I loved the Stanley Parable. I played it when it was, like, in beta, and I'll get into that, my love of Stanley Parable later. But if you've never heard of it, uh, I'll talk about it later. Yeah, it just, um, this game looked really good, it looked really fun, it's all about, like, forced perspective, uh, it's like a puzzle game, uh, but yeah, I recently was watching a video by Noodle, shout out, shout out to Noodle, and, um, uh, he was recommending games, and this was on there, and I was like, I've been wanting to play that game, why haven't I played that game? I should play that game, so, thanks to Noodle for the reminder, and... Uh, let's get into it. New game. Let's do it. I'm excited. I haven't played, uh, I haven't bought a game for the sake of just recording it in so long. <laughs> it was weird to me. Are you filled with feelings? Oh, is it talking? I can't hear it. It is talking. Okay. I should probably turn this TV up. It's major. Probably paying attention. Overflow parking lot of the University Medical Center. Somnuscult will make your dreams come true. Where are they going to make my dreams come true? I usually have really weird abstract dream, abstract dreams where they, they do they don't make any sense. And it, it like it just you know one of the dreams it just goes from like the next action packed minute to the to the next so my brain doesn't stop to question everything. I'm sure that I think that's fairly common. Like your brain won't let it let your let it stop to think about what's going on because it knows it won't make sense. All right. Well, left stick is move. Right stick is look around. Nothing too crazy or new there. Okay. And all right. Yep. Okay. It's one going one them kind of games there. All right. Oh, I thought I was gonna read that. I thought I was gonna read that. I thought I thought it was like a grab motion. Okay. So it looks like we are we're, we're asleep when we watch something that said like hey, we're going to make your dreams come true and now we're in a room. I know I only know about the concept of this game and how it just kind of fucks with you. It's very like meta. Um very like huh? very like you know like look back, look forth, things are going to change, perspective. It's a big thing with it. Um that's all I know though. So, I'm excited to dive into it. Perception is reality. Grab. So, this one I do grab. Okay. Okay, yeah. This is what I know. Because I watched the little trailer for it. Like, it gets, like, bigger. Yeah. So, yeah, like, yeah. Because I pick it up. And then it's like, oh, if that was actually right above me, that'd be huge. That's huge. <laughs> and then you just keep like going and it will just keep getting bigger and bigger and bigger until it can't get no bugger and I probably can make it smaller too if I like pick it up from like here and do the same kind of thing right yeah okay well let's bring one of these guys I'm sure it'll be useful or maybe it won't it will just be in my way okay so I gotta pick it up from like here, and then like, well, I can just move it though, I don't gotta make it smaller. Whoa, 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 what's happening there? Whoa. Whoa. Neat, okay. I'm gonna jump over these ones. What did that, what did that side say? Oh, X to jump. I thought it said don't jump. Terms of service accepted. Congratulations on falling asleep. I did Welcome fall asleep. 
Your progress may be monitored by qualified specialists. This orientation will adapt you to eyelids, our interactive, lucid induction dream state in which you retain full consciousness and control. Okay, sit right, okay. I I'll check and see if I have the microphone set to the thing where it doesn't pick up any volume behind it. I think I don't, but I'm not gonna fuck with it. And then, uh, you know, we'll just deal with it. Um, okay, so, it's a chessboard, a block, a big block. Uh, I don't think this game is um, terribly long. It was $20. Can I, like, move the things without, like... No. I can only move them by, like, by moving. There's no, like, gravity gun type thing. Um, it was 20 bucks. Um, but there is a... Uh, there is a trophy for beating it, like, in 30 minutes. So I imagine it can't be, like, too, too long. <laughs> uh... No objects behind this point at all times. Whoa. Oh, whoa. Okay. Well. But I can go in. But I can't bring this in. No, okay. No, I stand on the button. So it's like Stanley Parable meets Portal. Can I, like, grab that from here? Here we go. Can't grab it back. Well, oh, all right. What uh? What do you do? What do you do now? Oh, do I go? Do I try and go through there? Up there. So if I get close to it, pick it up, make it look big, and do that again, and now I should be able to. Well, no, I gotta do it again. Now I should be able to do it. Yeah, all right. Can't pick those boxes up. Confirm. You can move freely, interact with surrounding objects, and listen to messages from your patient care team. Please note that I am the standard orientation protocol, and that my voice has been explicitly chosen to remind you that I am not a part of your patient care team. I do not care. <laughs> Thanks for not caring. Too many people care nowadays. I'm always saying that. I'm always saying. Too many people care. Not enough people don't care. Oh, okay. How do I, uh... How do I, uh... Oh, I made it too tiny. I don't want it to be tiny. I want it to be big. I still have had I'm having, like, some trouble, like, figuring out the best way. To, like, make it big and small. Like, I feel like I make it bigger by, like, folding it up like that. By bringing it closer to me, basically. Uh, I don't want this to be too big. It won't fit the door. How the hell am I supposed to do this? Nope. Um, hmm. I guess I have to make it, like, really, really big while it's in there. How do I... How can I make it bigger? How can I make it... How do I make big... Oh, wait. Did I... No. Hmm. Yeah, there's no way to move it. Here we go. Well, that's very big. Oh, maybe I just grab it from a distance. Yeah, it just stops there, though. Oh, okay, there, oh, no. Oh, I see, because the pipe, oh, oh, it's, like, back behind there, and, oh, fuck, okay, well, all right, the pipe is, like, making it, the shat, ah, ah, the pipe was making it, so it looked like it was closer to me, rather than going behind the pipe, okay, okay, Nice to know there's some still some little secrets in this uh, that I haven't figured out or haven't seen already. Because like I said, I watched just the like the video like the when it came out, like uh, the trailer for it. That's what it's called. Hold L and R to rotate. Oh, this is cheese. Cheese here. So grab it. So I can rotate it. Okay. 
I just can't like bring it back and forth. Oh, because I want it to be a ramp. Oh, I see. I see. I believe this is a Gouda? A red wax Gouda, if I'm not mistaken. Although, a uh, Gouda I normally see does not have this kind of like very, like these speckled little things on it. But you know, one's Gouda is another's Goo Don't. Goo Goo Do. Goo Do. I'm glad I can't crush myself. That'd be very annoying. Oh my gosh. Okay. How big do you want this cheese? Sir? How big do you want this cheeseburger? Uh, maybe I'm getting too close to the wall. Like, maybe this is fine right here. Whoop! There we go. During eyelids, you will lose the ability to awaken suddenly due to realizing that this is a dream. Evidence. I have already informed you that this is a dream. You did not wake up. Okay. Please complete the remaining orientation activities. It's very, uh, very portal. Well, how come one of the clocks is... Oh, no, two of the clocks are different. One's, like, military time. But it's still a different time. And that one's also military time. But it's a different time. Hmm. Also, time's not moving. Granted, I wasn't there a whole minute. But I'm not going to sit there a whole minute. That's crazy. Is this another slice of cheese? Oh, no, it's a button. Uh, I need something to put in there. Oh. Hello. Anything come from anything good come from rotating you? <laughs> I am getting sleepy. Oh, that's that's creepy. Uh, sudden horror game maybe. <laughs> okay, oh, that is a tiny little cube. Okay, well, obviously, I'm going in the creepy death room. Does it work on these two? Oh, yeah, look, it got tiny. Very, uh, very Half-Life over here. Dream soda. I some kind of pipe I can't pick up. Warning. You have deviated from the orientation pathway. At the Pierce Institute, patient safety is a keynote mm. in our corporate priority tetrahedron. A variable degree of force can and will be authorized to ensure patient safety. Red Please soda. Please return to the orientation pathway. I want to drink this. <laughs> this giant soda just hit me in the gash dang head. Green soda. A what? Hey. Hey. Oh, I wanted to see all the sodas. All I got was stupid red soda. Which is Coca-Cola. You know, the best soda. I don't I don't actually I don't actually think that. I actually dislike soda. <laughs> I'm very uh boring when it comes to drinks. I'm like water, beer, and coffee is all I drink. Um I don't think I can actually do anything over here. I mean I can bring this soda with me, which I'm gonna do. Because why not? Um, but yeah, if I I do drink the like if I were to drink soda, oh come on, let me take the let me take the sodi pip. What if I get thirsty? So smooth and red. <laughs> it took me a second to read that. I guess it could be read. Um. Oh, hey, Overwatch installed, guys. <laughs> oh, there's a button down there. Um, hmm. Okay. Well, we pick this up, and we put it over there. How do I, like, get it over there, though? Is the... Do I probably got to make it small enough so it looks like it's over there? Not about perspective. Perception is reality. Okay, so there we go. Well, I'm getting it. All environments perceived during eyelids should reflect a typical mental state. If you believe your mental state was compromised by Somnascal, please provide a comprehensive, rational explanation in your post procedural survey. Completed surveys may be eligible for a gift card. Uh... Oh, God. 
Okay, so it's too big. I gotta make it smaller. Okay. Uh, here we go. And... There we are. Oh, 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 that would've been sick. Um, oh, sodas. Yeah, I used to love Mountain Dew. I, I don't... I feel like Mountain Dew Baja Blast is great. Uh, no items. Video surveillance. People without items beyond this point will be fine. Funded by Mothers Against Items. Warning, people beyond this point will obviously be fined it. Well, find. Find it. Uh, suspension of dream license up to one year. Fines from one lost night of sleep to four. What? Fines from... Oh, fines from, like, up to one lost night of sleep to four. Be smart. Think you're not objecting. Well, I can't put items over there anyway, so... So I need it to be open. Oh. Horrific. Uh, I was going to say Dr. Pepper or Baja Blast Mountain Dew. Probably sodas that I, like, really still enjoy. And even Dr. Pepper. I still like Coke. You know, but I don't... I just don't try to drink them because they're so bad for you. As much as, like, you know... Like, I, I would say Baja Blast is probably, like, the only soda I still, like, really enjoy. Like, when I drink Coca-Cola, I'm like, this hurts me. I like this, but it hurts me. Eight. What? Oh. Okay. Um. Well, that one has pawns and knights on it, and this one has... What's that? Bishop and a queen? No, it's a... No. Oh, it's all of them. It's all of them. It's not just... Okay, I see the rook. Or just the rook. And a bishop. Nah, they're all over the place. But this one's just pawns and knights. Okay. wonder if that's symbolic of anything. Uh, but yeah. I, uh, don't like Pepsi at all. Which, in, uh, really probably drives my, my boy Violrak crazy. He loves Pepsi. He's all about his Pepsi. He's a Pepsi boy. I can't. I didn't just, it's not something I never really drank as, like, a kid. So, just, like, it tastes to me as, like, it should taste to adults poison the way all soda should taste <laughs> when i drink pepsi i'm like Ugh. oh the sign itself <laughs> it's still turning green and red that's funny wait do i need oh does this just open that one in case i wanted to go back oh okay i can't go back though right, why would i want to go back weird Oh, or now I... Okay. Oh, wait. Can I take this one off? Wait. What the... Oh, what the heck is going on here? Oh. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. I gotta make it big. I gotta make it really big. So it's both the buttons. Did I do it? No, we're not doing it. Not yet. Okay, hold on. There you go. Damn perspective! <laughs> uh, still gotta talk about the Stanley Parable. And, oh, don't fall on me! No! Not like this, God! Oh. Okay. I'm fine. <laughs> yeah, I was fine. I, I wasn't worried. I wasn't worried about anything. I'm a big, I'm a big, brave guy. I'm a big, brave guy. Okay. So, like this. There we go. <laughs> like the guy's like, oh, I don't know. <laughs> uh, oh. I wanted to say something else, too. Game Informer? There's so much to talk about, guys. Please stand by for polite recognition on your completion of the Somna Sculpt orientation. You did it. To maximize the time allotted for your therapeutic journey, please do not delay in proceeding through the final doorway as indicated. Okay. Hmm. That's that's a little that's a little sus. That's a little sus there, guys. Oh, well, we got another one over here now. Uh, also a little sus here, fellas. Well, let's see what's through the door. That'd be a brick wall. That'd be a brick wall, guys. It's a brick wall, fellas. Can't can't much do. Can't much do much about that. I can probably go with that cheese. And, uh... Well, I don't know what that's gonna do. 
Nothing I can grab here. Oh, good. Far Cry 5 install. <laughs> uh, make cheese big. Make cheese really big. Wait, if I pick it up like from here, isn't that like a. Wouldn't that make it bigger faster? If I get close to it. Uh, and then, like, can I knock down this wall with it? Maybe there's something else I gotta grab. I'm, like, waiting for, like, something to pop up and, like, scare me. <laughs> uh, can't get any objects past there. I see a box. I can't grab. Maybe, maybe I just keep making the cheese really big? And, like, that'll, like, shake it. Like, I'll shake, like, the floor. Is it doing anything? Like, it'll be like, oh, no, an earthquake. I feel like, are they moving or am I crazy? Yes? Oh, maybe I'm just supposed to jump at, like, the top of it. And, like, use this as a ramp again. Because it is the cheese. And everyone does know, the cheese stands alone. Uh, okay, so now I can use it as, like, a ramp, unless I... Oh, there we go. Oh, well, I did just have to hit it. Alright. Eh, it's a brick wall. Oh, more walls fell. Okay. i just go underneath these. I thought those were beds to the left. Hmm... Alright, is there anything over here? Can't press any of these buttons. I can't see through these doors. What kind of facility is this? Dumpsters. Uh, okay, so I'm just going to go through the other one. Yeah, I was going to say the Game Informer. Before I talk about the Stanley Parable later. Because uh, I was thinking about probably making these like 30 minute episodes. If it's, the game's not that long. Travicone, gimme, gimme, gimme. Oh. Um... Yeah, Game Informer was like, I actually miss it. Like, I was thinking about it the other day. I used to get, like, them all the time. I used to get them, like, all the time. And then I uh, stopped, like, because I was like, this is bad for the environment. And I don't really read these. And who cares about Game Informer? Like, I don't take their reviews seriously or anything. So, fuck them. So, I, uh, I, I was, like, still subscribed to, like, their Platinum thing. Which I probably shouldn't be. But, whoa. Okay. I was subscribed to, like, their Platinum membership thing, which I probably shouldn't be because it's useless and I don't use it. But, uh, yeah, I still, so I still get them digitally, but I, you know, who, I don't think anybody really reads Game Informer anymore. It was nice to have, like, a physical magazine that I could, like, look through and, like, stuff, like, back before the internet was what it was. Did I say loading a thousand? Okay. We're awake. In our tiny little room. Hmm, maybe this is a good spot to end the episode, actually. You know what? We'll do that. We'll end the episode here, because this is a pretty good stopping point. And we've been playing for like 20 ish minutes anyway. Um, when we come back, we're going to explore the waking world. Although I don't actually think we're awake. Uh, what time does this clock say? I'm just curious. 3 a.m. Yeah, we're not awake. We're not awake. And the door is also smaller. I. No, it's not. Okay, I don't think we're awake. When we come back, we're going to be exploring this quote-unquote waking world and uh, see what they uh, have waiting for us. Thanks so much for watching. We'll also finish my thought on GameStop I had 20 minutes ago. And please remember to always stay stoned. I'm, I'm bad at this now. <laughs> I used to be good at this.